Hi YouTube, today I'm going to be going through my top 10 Cydia downloads for the jailbroken new iPad, the iPad 3. So first of all, at number 10, I'm going to start off with Barrel. This is basically a tweak that allows you to put in custom um, page transitions. So say you go, you go into settings and go on Barrel and say you click curl up and roll away. Go off of that. And then when you turn it, all the icons roll up, move like that. Uh, this is barrel two. Barrel one basically has all the same. This has just got a few new ones. You can do like cube outside, say, like that. It's a bit buggy, a bit laggy, glitchy, but then that'll probably be improved. Uh, yeah, so this I think is a paid tweak, but you can get it free from a source that I'll put below. Uh, at number nine, I have MX Tube, which is basically an app uh, that helps you download YouTube videos easily and simply by just searching them in this little magnifying glass from YouTube, <coughs> um, and that lets you download them in high quality and low quality and HD. And you can also stream them through that, and then they're saved to that for whenever you want to delete them and watch them. Uh, number eight is ProTube. Um, which is basically the YouTube app. It's just been <laughs> improved a huge amount. You've got everything you wanted to do on it. So you can watch videos in HD, you can download videos, um, you can basically do everything you want, you can do on the normal desktop version, but on the iPad. Number seven, I have Full Force. Which is an app that allows you to play to use the uh, iPhone apps on your iPad, um, uh, blown up to the iPad screen size without it like lagging at all. So I'll just go to one now. So Blogger, this is an iPhone app. As you can see, that's gone right up to the screen size because normally you have the little magnifying glass in the corner like two times the size as one times the size as well uh, so that allows it to be full screen and as you can see it's like adapted to it as well so there's no like black areas and stuff number six I have gridlock Let's put that back up uh, I have gridlock which means you can say you can go into wiggle mode or whatever it's called and you can literally just take the app and drop it anywhere on the screen, this is useful for when you like doing themes as well, where you move the apps around. And it's not working. Oh, here it is. There you go, so you can just drag those anywhere. Like that. Um, at number five, I have Dreamboard, which is basically an advanced theming. Um, uh, Blah, blah, blah. app thing uh, that's not the right one go back to that uh, box of HD for iPad so basically you download these themes and it's like a much com it's a complete um, version of the theme that's just been built for you in front of you hang on let's just rotate that well so like that and then everything's built in you can get widgets and everything like that you got little fake. You got like a Facebook um, widget there. You got edit mode, weather. You can rotate it. It's basically, just like that. So now I'll go back to Dreamboard. And you can download themes for that. Sometimes they cost. Sometimes they don't. But uh, you can download them from that source that I'll put in the video below uh, and get them all for free. Uh, so number four, I have Dashboard X, which is what I have these widgets here on the home screen, like that, the clock widget and the SB widget. Uh, these basically allow you to add, um, well, widgets to your home screen. Um, well, there's like activation methods, so like you can hold down, you hold the screen, and it'll come up with these, and you can add in widgets like, say, battery info, add widget. <coughs> and that will have brought the battery widget there so you can move that around and wherever you want and then just tap the home button and it will get left there so of course you can use gridlock to move all the apps out of the way 
and everything like that. So uh, number three is Instalus, which is you can download from uh, cydia.hackulo.us source. Uh, this is Instalus 5, which basically means you can download all the apps for free. You've got basically all the categories there. You can search anything and then you just hit download and it installs it for you. Um, so you get everything for free, but then you can't use it, say, if you sync it to another device because it's the software built into the jailbreak that lets it run. Uh, number two is Mountain Lion Center, which is an alternative no to Notification Center, which is basically the same on the Mountain Lion for Mac, where basically you use two fingers to slide across, and you can get all your notifications in here, and you can put Dashboard X widgets in there, and you get all your notifications and everything like that. I find it really useful because uh, I've got like respring, reboot, power off, and everything, time, and stuff like that. See, so then you can just close it like normal. So, number one for my top 10 city of downloads is Spring to Mice 2. My friend showed me this one, and it's basically you can do anything with it. You can change the carrier, as I've done, the banner, even the carrier. You can change anything you want to basically. You can change how many icons you have on the dock, stuff like that. Uh, it's just advanced theming for anybody that really wants to. You can change the amount of, well, this is quite a nice one actually. For the lock transition, you can get like an old TV lock as well, which my friend also showed me. Hang on, let me just put the camera back up. Uh, where you lock it and it goes like that. I find that quite cool. And you can change anything basically on it. Um, so notifications until let's just say we go into that. You can disable it. You can blur the background, but I've got this disabled because uh, I have Mountain Lion Center. Uh, so yeah, if you want to download that, I'll put a, a list of all these tweaks below in the video. So thank you for watching my top 10 Cydia tweaks and downloads. Please comment, rate and subscribe to my channel. Uh, like the video. Thanks for watching.